as usual, to prep your case means installing the power supply unit and its IO shield. And talking about power supply unit, we have a fully modular 750 watt platinum graded unit to install on our case today. Alright, let's take a closer look to our case. This one is actually quite exciting. We got plenty of spaces and places to hide our drives in. In red are solid state drive pockets. In green are middle and bottom hard disk drives cages. And finally, in white, our optical drive tray. One last component I'd like to talk about. Um, we do have a LED strip on this case, and that's going to help us make this build look absolutely incredible. Let's take a closer look to the back of our case. Alright, now that's pretty cool. That's an LED slash fan controller. And this is when you realize that the case manufacturer is not kidding around. We actually can turn this thing into a Christmas tree if we wanted to. Not mentioning the fact that because we have so many fan connectors, it would be easy for us to install a custom water cool loop on this thing. So yeah, overall, I'm pretty excited about this case. Okay, let's take a look at the front panel. Other than our usual reset and power button, and our usual USB 2 and USB 3 plug, headphone and microphone jacks, we have a Type-C USB inlet, and that's pretty cool. Alright, it's not over. We also have a fan um, controller button, as well as a LED controller button. Last point, uh, there is a filter hidden under a magnetic shield on top of your case. Could be handy, I don't know, uh, just thought I would mention it. Okay, let's start with the actual build. First things first, let's put in the power supply unit. Make sure to remove all the stickers and that the fan points downward. The installation of the PSU is pretty easy here. Just remove the PSU bracket and slide in your power supply in place. It should fit right in. Once done, just put back the PSU bracket back in place. Last thing for PSU, we need to screw it onto the case bracket. Last section of this video, the IO shield installation. Pop it into place, no screws needed, just apply some pressure and it should go right in. 